Hey, this category has single-handedly um, ruined my, my dating life. How do you reckon this script is going to go? It's going to be really good. It's going to be good. Yeah. The Great Australian uh, Bake Off and um, The Cook Up with Adam Wheel uh, set ridiculously high standards for whipping up delicious meals. Gardening Australia, Costa, he makes it look, where is he? He makes it look so easy to keep plants alive. And then Grand Designs and Selling Houses put my two-bedroom apartment to shame and the living room. I mean, Dr. Chris Brown, who can compete with that jawline? I don't think that you can blame television for your bad dating game, Tommy. I, you know some of the lines we riffed backstage? Oh yeah, fuck, did I ruin that? No, you didn't, oh. but I don't reckon they're gonna go for them. Let's take a look at this year's nominees. Gardening Australia. We are not professional gardeners, but we have a passion, and that's all, we, all you need. Grand Designs Australia. You know, it's a challenge, and if it was easy, everyone would be doing it. Selling Houses Australia. This is a character buy. Mm. You fall in love with this house. Yeah. The Cook-Up with Adam Liao. We know that stories are often shared over a good meal, but what about using the food itself to help tell a story? The Great Australian Bake Off. But look at that. That's just... I just want to eat that. <laughs> oh, I hear that. The Living Room. Friday is my favourite night of the week because oh. I get to spend it oh. with my three best friends. Yes! Kind of, man. You're very Us. kind. And the actor goes to Gardening Australia. This is Jill Lomas's first actor award win, with Gardening Australia nominated last year for Best Lifestyle Program. This is such an honour, thank you so much. I um, have to start by thanking everyone who lets us into their gardens, parks, plant, <laughs> plant spaces every week because without them we wouldn't have been going for 40 hours every year for the last 34 years. <laughs> um, also want to really thank all of the, uh, the people back in the office, in the field, I know a lot of you will be saying you work with the best teams, but I'm afraid that is reserved for Gardening Australia's team. Yeah. They are just amazing. Not only are they incredibly professional, but they're the sort of people that you spend time with and they make you want to be a better person. And that really makes coming to work every day very special. And that includes our presenters, led by, and this, I can't take um, credit for this description, but led by this half man, half hedge beside me. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, thank you, Jill. Um, our crew turn up every day and they put together what our researchers research and bring to the table. They bring drones, they bring sliders, they bring all sorts of technology to capture the country we walk on. So I look through this and I ask you to look through this and I thank the actors for recognising that it's not about us, it's about what we're looking at. We're looking at incredible indigenous rangers out on country looking after country. We're looking at the gardeners. We're looking at the horticulturists, the tree lovers, the mayhem of moss and the lichen lovers, the land carers, everyone that's looking after this planet and leaving it in a better condition for those that follow. This is for everyone here and following us. Thank you. 